hard fought games for you guys where it's you guys played a lot of running gun hockey this year but it seems like these close ones are the ones that can the team can kind of build around going forward Definitely. I think uh, you know, the coaching staff has done a good job. We've uh, really focused on our defensive side of the game uh, lately. You know, we've been getting some great goaltending. We've really been clamping down in the D zone. And, uh, you know, when you play a hard fought full 60 minutes, like I thought we did tonight, and you, know, you got everybody chipping in, uh, you know, everyone playing hard, it's, uh, it's a lot of fun. And, you know, I think we need to play like that down the stretch. And I'm, I'm definitely happy with the result tonight. Penalty kill in general, this is when where Curtis goes up, so you guys have a couple more guys stepping in there and as a team I go five for five you can't ask for a better performance there no I mean the the penalty kill is something we've been working on all year and um, you know it's uh, it's big to have guys step uh, step in front of shots getting shot lanes and uh, you know really buying into the systems that the coaches have put in so um, you know everything's going in the in the right direction right now and uh, like I said I was happy with the result let's talk about the confidence you guys have right now riding the five game win streak uh, it's definitely it's big. Um, you know, you can't get too high, can't get too low uh, after wins or losses. But um, you know, whenever you can string a few wins together, it's always nice. Uh, you know, like you said, get a little bit of confidence. Um, but you know, this one's already over with. We got a big road trip coming up here against uh, you know some some big divisional games. And uh, you know, we're we're in the grind right now. We're in the home stretch, and um, you know, every game is important fighting for playoff position. How do you feel like the legs and just the body overall is feeling with the amount of games you guys had in January and kind of coming off that now in February and March? Well, we've had a rough rough patch in, in February here as well. We had a, a lot of games in a short period of time, but, um, you know, I think uh, we're well prepared for it. We, we see it coming on the on the calendar there, and, um, you know, we do whatever we can to, to get ready, and uh, at the end of the day, you just got to, you know, kind of work hard, we'll work through it, and, and hope for the best. This end board right here? Pardon me? Is this from the end board? Yes. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That's, uh, did you see it? I mean, I not see it, obviously. Was, was that cutting down, that cut into your vision or anything like that for the end of the game? Uh, it was actually on my last shift, so um, just kind of chased the puck down, took a hit, and, um, you know, started trying to back check into the zone, felt a little something so so changed, and uh, sure enough, there it was. Speaking of the end of the game, just talk about you guys were, really had to buy in uh, down, I think, six on four at one point, uh, trying to, like you were trying to get that last goal. Yeah, like we we were relentless tonight. Um, you know, they uh, they pulled their goalie uh, with a few minutes left, so they uh, you know outnumbered us five on four, six on five, whatever it was. And um, you know, we just had guys uh, working hard to get pucks out, getting in shot lanes, and and really buying in. I think it was uh, you know an unbelievable team effort tonight. Um, you know, Leggy played well as always, and you know we had a lot of guys uh, step up, and, and it was a good team win. Does he seem like he has? Could you kind of describe it as it seems like it almost has like an it factor about him, where he comes up kind of in those bi those big moments late in games, where he's kind of he finds the save when he needs it. Well, if you look at the way Leggy plays, he, he, no matter what, he always finds a way to keep you in the game. Whether uh, you know it's last night where we get down two three, and um, you know he's making some some big glove saves on backdoor passes, and um, you know huge breakaway saves to, to keep the game at that two or three nothing rather than get it to four or five. And um, <clears throat> you know that always makes it feel a little better when when you know you got a guy like that back there who's no matter what going to give you a chance to win on, on any given night. So you know he's been amazing for us, and uh, you know hats off to him. He's worked hard. Uh, he's earned his opportunity here, and uh, we're really happy for him. And we're you know really happy he's here with us. Hey, thanks, a lot. thanks, Derek. Thanks a lot, Derek.